up and Adam with General Atomic. At who, you may ask? At whom? In this case, the goddamn Institute. That fish could be a god oh, synth. I think it is a synth. My god. Just took the whole brunt of this plasma arc. So, uh, here we are, back in Fallout 4. As a reminder, as I said yesterday, I'm recording this episode right off the bat of last episode. Spent a long time crafting, fucking around with weapons, but generally, for the most part, yesterday, all we did was help out the railroad, even though they are a little bit weird. A little bit weird. I think they mean well, I suppose. So today, we're going to stick to the main storyline, and it's going to be the hunter and the hunted. Travel to CIT, Leonard Nimoy there, about to be shot in the back by the vault dweller. don't understand quite why that. <laughs> why that animation looks like that. Uh, there it is, CIT. Where's that big building? Oh, that is CIT. Ah, so when we were in that vertebrate uh, with the Brotherhood, I said, oh, what's that big building over there? We haven't in ever investigated that. If that's CIT, I feel like we should be going over there. Could they not call it MIT? Is that copyright or something? Is MIT in Boston? I, I don't know American geography. More than, more than most, I think, you would get in uh, the UK. I would put myself in maybe like the top 95% of UK people who understand American geography. Simultaneously. I don't think that's saying very much. <laughs> well, should we ignore the course of signal a second and go inside the, the, I presume, Central Institute of technology. Oh, bear in mind our pit boy doesn't work anymore. Our, our, our light, which is very frustrating. This dark experience. I, I mean, surely he would want to go and peek around. He's a man of science. Sit rotunda. That's a Rimbaud name right there. Oh. Super mutants versus synths. Wow. This building is uh, the epitome of institute hubris. <laughs> Speaking of hubris, we crafted at the end of yesterday. Look at the DPS. Fucking hell. A, uh, a cold fusion powered gorse rifle, um, which required us crafting a cold fusion core uh, through the use of creative liberties. Turns out it used an item that um, sadly can counts as junk, so I probably broke it down years ago. Uh, and a plant he had to, you know, stumble across another one, so to speak, and there's only one of them in the game, apparently. Okay, it's a dead end. We're missing all the action. Missing all the action. All that XP. Right. Just just being thorough. You know, have a look around. This is all te technology and everything. And so everybody loves that. They should put that on their sign. MIT. Technology and everything. Why can't we fly? What's wrong with our jetpack? Oh, well, there we go. We can also teleport, don't forget. Who's going to win, do you think? The synths or the mutants? What is this? Commonwealth. Open. Okay. Hmm, I feel like the mutants may have this Sensors one. Indicating concealed organic life form. Concealed? I'm not concealed. I'm open and proud. Hands down. Full attention. Ready to fight some synths. Why is this bathroom significantly... Oh, dear. Oh, she's had one too many. Why is this bathroom significantly nicer than this one? Oh. Huh, typical. Getting the short straw. What the? Down. You got to test these things. I thought it was a secret elevator. You got to test these things. Voice activated. <gasps> Descend. Right. Where the hell is this? Commonwealth Institute of Technology. That's where we want to. Oh, CIT is common. Okay. Commonwealth. What did I think it was? Central Institute. Ah, it's pretty good. Movement detected. Curious. Curious. It's not that curious though, is it? It's either a rat or a rad roach or your doom. Contact detected. Possibly. <laughs> Possibly. Cold fusion discharge detected. Okay, careful. Fragmentation grenade. Hello. Oh god, they've got those fucking rifles again. Beautiful. We love a bit of cold fusion. Probably shouldn't shoot a robot with cold fusion to make it run better. Oh, up to a certain point, I suppose. Give me that. Ow! Shit. Oh, God. You'll make these shots count. You'll make these shots count, big man. Hello. 
Whew. Not that we're worried about ammo. It's the fact that it takes a year for this bloody thing to charge up. I need to take the scope off of it. Very annoying. That's very annoying. Oh, okay. maybe you can't. Hello. It is I, Synth. General Atomic. Oh, my fucking God. Now, for whatever reason, just remember that this gun doesn't drain ammo. It did say that a cold fusion core is a thousand shots. I wonder if it's because of a perk we've got or something. A drain rate of weapons is reduced or something, and then because it's such a high capacity ammo or something to that effect. I'm not sure. Oh, the Sicilian. A lovely espresso machine. Is that supposed to be taking the piss? I don't drink coffee. I assume you don't need all of that for an espresso. That's insane. Oh, this is affected by your luck stat. I'm afraid we got unlucky. So spooky, isn't it? Be vigilant. Communism is coming. Oh. Hello there. I don't think we're looking for anything in particular here. Just kind of doing our due diligence and uh, exploring a potentially very valuable piece of Commonwealth history. Dealing with some synths, which have proven to be a menace to the wasteland. So that's good. The gen ones, at least. We drop down here. I guess we'll go through to the actual institute itself then. The, the Not the institute institute. I'm using shorthand for the... I understand the confusion there. Probably not the right play. This place. CIT. There's got to be something rare in here. You know there's got to be. Big laser gun. 8,000 DPS. We need a higher difficulty level. Oh, it just puts you outside. Well, for fuck's sake. <laughs> There's really no rare items in there at all. Surely I missed something, no? Okay, well, that's that then. There we are. Nothing in there but some super mutants and some fellas. Okay, it was a little light luster. Big Institute of Technology. I guess uh, the Institute Institute will have probably... Probably probably sucked up all that stuff. Right, Corsa signal. Bonk. Bonk. Okay, we got to move in the direction until it... Bonk. I think I've gone too far. Okay, back this way. 10%. we got to wait for all my loot to fuck off first. Zero. Seven. Bonk. Bonk. There you go. 18. Ooh. 25. This way. It's over here somewhere. 33. Come on. 39. Maybe over here. 40. 37. Wrong way. Triangulate. 40. Move over here. 43. 44. 45. I think in this direction. 46. 51. Hello. Oh. I'll never see it coming. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. Let's see if we can shoot it through that. 55. Thought you could hide. We'll deal with a couple of raiders first, and then we'll carry out. Oh, 62. Well, we're, we're inadvertently going in the right direction. Is it the big... It's this big green building. Is that the institute? Shoot wow. Them. Shoot them all. Talk about hiding in plain sight, huh? Oh, are you not dead? What the fuck? Beautiful. Legendary item over here. Hello there. Leather armor of the Sentinel. We did just spend all of our effect chips on giving this gun two shots, so... No! Loading screens are... Oh. Bloody Raiders again. I love that he did the little kind of, uh... You know, the little flourish there. The little... little I don't even... It was a hand gesture I have a name. Kind of beckoning, beckoning him over for a fight. What the hell was that? Hello. Oh, I'm surprised we're actually able to get in there. Jesus. You are so dead. Okay, hold on. Sorry. Hello. <laughs> General Atomic. Does he need to leave a calling card anymore? I'm, I'm in a pile of frozen raiders with inexplicably massive gorse holes. Madam, you'll have a mighty gorse hole. Give me that. What is in that office building again? I'm not interested. 
Who's over here? Hello? You're still alive? You can't hide. Oh. Goodbye. We're the good guy. Don't know if I've I don't know if I need to clarify that. We are the good guy. We are killing raiders, but we're like I mean they're not feeling any pain. They're not feeling any pain. This is necessarily so evil. Don't necessarily need to go on a wild goose chase like this to kill them. Jesus. There we go. Fucking hell. Yeah, you don't necessarily need to go on a wild goose chase to get them all hunted down. That's true. Hello. Not super accurate. Power relay coil. What the fuck is that? Give me that. Sorry. Uh, it's obviously the big green buildings. We'll go back over. Uh, it's not me saying that because I've played this game before. I genuinely do not remember where the fuck we're supposed to go. But I'm just going to assume that's the case given that it's, you know, right there. This is it then, huh? What is this? What is this building? Green Tech Genetics. You're telling me that a genetics building might have been the home for the Institute all this time? That's crazy, bro. I can't believe it. The place with no front door. That's insane. Kill the Corsa. Okay. Uh, do you think, is this actually the head Corsa or is this just a coincidence? Again, I genuinely do not remember. Well, that's a bit, uh... It's a bit spooky, isn't it? It's cool. I like it. I'm not gonna turn the. I'm not gonna turn it off. Enjoying the uh, the tension. The tension that comes as a side effect. Of this. on the second floor. Kill on sight. Oh. Send reinforcements to the lobby in case there are more. Oh, I remember this quest. What? I remember this quest. Yeah, this is an absolute bloodbath, isn't it? It's all coming back to me. Oh yeah, no, this is this is cool. Hello. How many are they dealing with, huh? Would have been awesome if it was just one. It could still be awesome. I don't know if it is one. Ooh, a mighty pipe sniper rifle. Wow, talk about polishing a turd. Goodbye. Hello. General Atomic here. The courser is now on the third floor. Reports of the second intruder in the east wing near the courtyard. That's me. They're talking about me. Yay. I've been recognized. Who's there? Hello. <laughs> Broke into the ladies' bathroom to murder her. That was very rude. Hello. <laughs> Beautiful bandana. Wow, you see that? We. I didn't try if we could wear the glasses. Oh, we'd look so much cooler with that. Hold on. Uh, Corsa goggles. No. Is it that on the optics prototype? Hang on, which looks better? Hold on. Sorry, I know this isn't the right time to be talking about. Ooh, it's hard to tell. It's hard to, well, I can't see. Ooh, he looks a bit... He doesn't... <laughs> he looks a little bit too Deus Ex cosplay doing that. Yeah, stick with that. That way you can see he's got a kind face below the surface. Ooh, Massachusetts Surgical Journal. Probably inflict 1% limb damage. Beautiful. Get some! Now, now you get some. <laughs> get some justice. Ridiculous, man. Okay, the beeping's got a little bit gracing at this point. Barricade stairwells and hallways if you haven't already. What kind of fucking army are you running if you haven't to tell them that? Oh, by the way, if you haven't done it, barricade the stairwell. I want this one's head. See, this is why he's the leader. He's the smart one. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> is that Guile? I just killed a family man. Oh. Wow, lots of pre-programmed explosions. Makes you think there's a massive firefight going on, but it's all smoke and mirrors. I think it is just one person, isn't it, in hindsight? Give me that cram. I should probably be picking up that laser pistol, but ammo's not really a problem. Sectors 2 and 4, compromised. Sorry, I'm trying to repress hiccups again. Oh, dear. Oh, what's a total mess? Jesus. I'm not leaving this stuff on it, you know, just like lying around. I need that. This is useful stuff. Good, good, good science, you know. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> ah. 
It's my favorite Lord of the Rings character, Legless. It's a little anticlimactic when the enormous firefight stops. And all you can hear is the beep booping. Given that they're supposed to be doing everything they can to stop this Corsair or fight this Corsair. How do they know what a Corsair is? I guess they're not exactly so... Not like some sort of secret agent. But everybody's referring to it as the same thing. Do they go around saying, Hello, I'm an Institute Corsair. I need a chat. Like, I don't really understand that. It's the awesome tales. We love a good bit of pulp. Honestly, that man deserved to die. <laughs> to be fair, that might not have even been planted. That could have been a... Uh, could have been uh, self-inflicted. Oh, disgusting Jangles the Moon Monkey. I hate him. Finding lots of technical documents for... Uh, Pro the, the Proctor Doctor. I don't remember his name. Doctor Fella. The snivelly. You know, that sniveling nerd in the Brotherhood. Oh, he probably probably talks like this. Oh, get me some technical documents I like to read because I love science. Oh. Oh, Veritasium. Oh. I love Nile Red. Oh, be gone. Hold on, let's get a little closer. Hi there. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I love that we fight since and it's like two shots and they've killed us dead and I've got to like teleport around and be very very careful we fight these people and it's just we're just robocopping it walk forward in a straight line hip fire don't stop for anything don't give them the time of day epic background music playing da 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 okay off we go then. Where's the fellow that's been shouting? Grenade there. Watch out for that. <laughs> Thank God for that. Thank God we're so stealthy. Hello. Is this the <coughs> you fucking throw a Molotov at a uh -oh, man? What's wrong with you? Rude fella. Jesus. There's also someone else trying to shoot at us, but they haven't yet realized there's a wall in the way. Does anyone wonder why these gunners aren't getting very far? Mm, hello there. God, it's so dark. My God. We've replaced the annoying click clack of robot -y footsteps for beep, 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 beep. You're not so bad yourself. <laughs> Go around and loot it. It's, it's just the ultimate disrespect, isn't it? They're fighting for survival. They've barricaded this place. Private military unit. And Planty is just like going through their cabinets, picking up their broom. Hello. Gonna private. <laughs> Can't find out anything about him. Very reserved. He must be their leader. <laughs> Give me those dog tags. Give it to Borf Wufty. Little, little, little Mabel, Mabel fella. I oh, was the big guy. I was kind of hoping we fight like Gonna General. Or whatever. Mr. Mr. Great Trope character there. How many of you motherfuckers are coming up these stairs trying to kill me? And he's got like a, he's got like a cigar, in one hand, rifle in the other, massive handlebar mustache. Just Mr. Trek. No, he, he lands on the roof, hanging off the bottom of a helicopter. That's it. That's what's happening. He's got enormous muscles and a green tank top. Right, let's go ahead and... Uh, I, I could figure this out. I, I really just do not have the brain power today, I'm afraid. Recuper. Super Recuper. Don't do this to me. Uh, boom. There you go. Security door control. Open. What is this for? Uh... Oh, fucking two fusion cores. Oh, goddamn. Well, there might be a lot of turrets around here. Keep your eyes peeled. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I feel like it's it's the it's the underscores of this entire mission, isn't it? This is the this is the BGM for this one for this area. 
Better safe than sorry. I don't know the password. I'm telling the truth. I don't believe you are. Z2. Oh, God. Please, no. Right. Can I have a look? I mean, they can. I mean, All what. All you had to do was tell me the password. Now. Let's be honest. I mean, what the hell are we going to do? No, don't kill those gunners that we just gunned down a thousand of to get up here. Yeah, let him think. We're not in any rush. <laughs> what is in here that's so important? Gunner Sergeant. Well, that's not really the general, is it? I'm telling you, the general's going to come in on a helicopter. He's going to come in on a helicopter. He's going to be ripped. Massively but muscled. He's going to look like a backy character. Green tank top. Hanging off the edge of a helicopter. Minigun in one arm. Cigar between his lips. Bottle of beer in the other. What in the hell's going on in here? The land is going to go slam. Oh. Get over here. Hello. Are you here for the synth? Uh, I'm here to pick up an order. Two large pepperoni and a calzone. Name is, uh, fuck you. No, I'm I'm here for, uh, to help the synth. And you think I'll just hand her over to you? You've been tracking me. What do you really want? <laughs> so, can you please turn off your radio? It's very annoying. Uh, uh, we're on a need-to-know basis here, and you don't need to know. Suit yourself. You'll die like the rest of them. Oh dear, you poor fool. <coughs> wow. Man can take some shots. What is that you've got going on there? Was he supposed to use a stealth boy? I can see your hair. <laughs> you need a little help over here. K1. Hello. I didn't realize there was a synth involved. Weird. Oh, was she, was she bait? I really don't remember the setup to this quest. It's been so bloody long. I thought it was Virgil. I was like, oh, you need a Corsa. I don't remember there being anything about a synth. Why were the gunners protecting her? I don't know what was going on. Um, short pulse carbine rifle. Well, you weren't going to kill anybody with that. It does 39 damage there, fella. Corsa uniform. Something for the rogue of... The, the rogue of villains? Yes, the rogue of villains. Help me. I'll help you one second, please. I'm just looking for some stuff. Ooh. Okay, we don't need another fat man. The molecular level have the Corsa chip analyzed. No one could teleport. That's ridiculous. Right, let's have a look. Uh, hacker voice. Yeah, oh, this is a simple system for me to uh, hack into. 256-bit encryption. This will take me all of uh, about two seconds. Boom. Okay, I have the password. Hello. X01 left leg. Thank you. I don't know what to say. Uh... You mustn't have heard. I'm a superhero. I do this for a living. My institute designation is K198. But I prefer Jenny. So yes, I'm a synth. If you hadn't already guessed. I knew they'd send a courser. I just didn't think you'd find me so fast. I think I would have lost him too. But then I was captured by these mercenaries. Oh, so they weren't trying to help her then. <laughs> all this happened. Oh, I understand. Thanks again for your help. I'm going to look for supplies before heading out. You won't find any. I've taken ask, them all. No, I don't need any more help. I wasn't going to ask. Commonwealth is unforgiving. I need to make it on my own or I'm dead. Maybe we'll meet again under better circumstances. I hope we do. Say, uh, how do you fancy going and getting your brain wiped? But no. She doesn't fancy having her whole personality rewritten for the purposes of security. No, she's not into that. You've got to be serious about security, okay? Check your local password provider and see if they offer pass keys. You have to set up like Windows Hello and it's a massive pen yard, so I wouldn't recommend it. Well, I mean, obviously you should do it. But then, you know, Microsoft have your email, your password, and then if you press tab, your full name pops up in the middle of a Fallout video. <laughs> Speaking from experience. <laughs> ah, what a beautiful day. What was that over there? Oh, it's Diamond City. And there we are. We've done it. We've saved the world. That's the Institute stopped. We did it, everyone. We stopped the Corsa. With that, we've saved the Commonwealth. Oh, this place is... 
delicious. What the fuck is this? I don't remember this. Uh, ghoul Central. Okay, then. Uh, if you don't mind, I have my anti-ghoul weapon lying around somewhere. Just give me uh, one second here. Hello! Alright, that'll do it. Just uh, clear things out here and there. Careful. I imagine there's... I imagine there's quite a lot of um, radiation down there. So maybe... Maybe don't go too close. It could also be crazy loot. So I mean... We can teleport right over and come, but this is a, this is a great day. Who's up there? Probably another ghoul. There is something here. I think there's something... Oh, I was going to say, I think there's something invisible that's stopping us. Ooh. You know, I really expected the radiation to be far higher. I guess not. It's just, this, it's just a stinky pond. Okay. Beautiful. Problem solved. Well, um, that's good. I don't remember this. <coughs> oh, God, that's got a massive area of effect. Wow. I really don't remember that at all. The fuck? Okay. Well, let's drop some stuff. Uh, let's close some enemies out very briefly. And then we don't need the missile launcher, for God's sake. Yeah. Oh, no, we're still not done. Hold on. <laughs> we're still not going to lose a lot of legendary items today. My God. Um, we don't need those. I think they break down into useful stuff, so I'm trying to hang on to it. What's laser rifle? We'll see if we can upgrade that at all. Switchblade, we don't need. Laser rifle, we don't need. Laser pistol, we don't need. Auto pistols, I think I'm good. Thank you. Okay, then. Hello. Oh, it's bloody synth. <coughs> Careful there. Synth components, do we need those? I'm going to take them because I feel like they could be could be quite useful. So things are just over here fighting fighting raiders, is that it? That's good. We can fight some. Hello. <laughs> Never quite gets old, does it? Much like her. Beautiful. What a gun. I like all these guns that we've built. It's a shame the plasma rail doesn't do just a slight bit more of a punch. Because then I'd feel a little bit... You know, I feel a little bit better about using it, but it's just so bloody weak. Um, we don't need that, thank you. Weird. God knows what this place is. Doesn't seem like it's particularly important. There is probably something we missed over there. Those buildings, that, that like, that, that symbol on the map always seems to be, like, old. Who knows what the hell's going on over there. We'll check that out, too. They always seem like old pre-war science facilities and stuff like that. I can't even see you. What the fuck? There you are. Right. Where were we? What the hell is that flame going on? Ah! Careful that. Still kind of new to the teleportation tech. Okay, there is something going on over here. Ooh. Nice place you got here. Shame that you face General Atomic. Okay. See any others? Lock, lock safe in there. Going through the window. You'd never see that coming, would they? Okay, neither would I. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Fortnite. Oh, wait. Was this a railroad place? <laughs> you can't just assume everywhere over the land is a railroad place, for God's sake. We might be raiders, but we want to help people. <laughs> we want to help the synths. Yeah, we don't need those. Thank you. Corsa goggles. I'm absolutely keeping those. We'll put, we'll put that on. Even though our Corsa that we thought wasn't wearing them, we'll put them on in our... Or we'll put them in our, our, our villains gallery. Somebody said uh, in the comments, you should fill that big tunnel in the new base with all of the uh, all of the, all of the <coughs> Rose Gallery stuff. I don't remember if I even picked up the Rose Gallery stuff from the drive-thru. So we'll, we might have to go back and uh, transplant it all over at some point. Ooh, ooh, flip lighters. Thank you. What have you got for me? Canned dog food. Delicious. <coughs> Hello. We should start leaving some alive so they can go and tell their other raider friends about the... Because uh, they know about the Silver Shroud. What we've done is effectively just put an enormous target on the back of uh, Nick Valentine. Very rude in hindsight. We've just really fucking ruined his life, haven't we? Never really considered that. We made all the raiders terrified. The Silver Shroud was a means to an end. And then we pulled it off on someone else to deal with the heat. Horrible boy you are. Ah, here we are. Uh, yes, go. Thank you. Appreciate that. 
All right, there it is. Now, what was that building? Oh, let's go and have a look over here. Because apparently, even though we've got map markers all the way around it, apparently I missed something in this direction. I'll be honest, I don't even really know where we are right now relative to the rest of the Commonwealth. I'm trying to figure it out. Is this near... No, I actually don't know where we are. Yeah, look, we've, we've done a massive circle around this and somehow missed the entire thing. The feral ghouls in the graveyard is tremendously lazy design. I'm not happy about this, Todd. As lazy as fuck. You should be ashamed of yourself. They're not bloody zombies, even though they basically become zombies. Fallout... I, I was looking at the wiki the other day. Fallout 1 ghouls were, were so iconic. Same with Fallout 2, of course. They were, you know, very similar games. Fallout 3 ghouls were horrific. But they had their kind of own unique feeling to them still. Collegiate administration building. Okay, maybe not then. We'll come back to that. We'll know if we've been there because it'll say cleared on it. I'm just going to go ping some map markers. I feel like we've missed a lot in this area. North. Wherever we are. Here we are. Cambridge Campus Diner. Oh. Bad boy. <laughs> Eating these damn people. Oh, Gunner's note. Lots of letters. Oh, it's a postman. Oh, God. Of all the people to eat. That's a massive offense. What is that? Returnal post 115. Ooh, maybe some big guns in there. We'll hold off for now. And over here we have Cambridge Polymer Labs. Right, this is one people kept saying, telling me to come over and have a look at. Something in there that might be quite useful. We probably don't have time today to be cracking on with another big long quest line. So let's go and uh, follow up on. Have to call the chip analyzer. Let's go follow up on this then. Seems we're supposed to be doing main quest. Analyzed by who? Brian Virgil? Is that his name? I feel like his first name is Brian. Oh, we've got to go to the bloody railroad. No. Oh, I said we were going to try and avoid that. I don't want to help the railroad necessarily. I think railroad and Minutemen are compatible though, aren't they? So that I, I think that's maybe the best way to go about it. We're a nice guy. You're from one of those vaults? Hello. You got too many teeth to be a scammer. I have a report here. It reads more like a comic book. Apparently, one hell of a fight took place at Green Tech Genetics. Ah, uh, that was me. I took down a Corsa. That's what the report says. Hard to believe. I'm all for one less Corsa in the world, but the conventional wisdom is that you run from them rather than engage them. I mean, it wasn't that impressive. So why did you kill him? Uh, it's, I, I need a Corsa chip. I need the code on it. Do you know anything about decoding a Corsair chip? You have one of their chips intact? Follow me now. Whoa, calm down decoding then. a Corsair chip is a very delicate operation. A million things can go wrong. The least of which is losing the data. Fortunately, we have the right man for the job. I do trust hey, a man with man. that on his head. You need something? Tom, we got a Corsair chip. Whoa, for real? Oh man, it's been ages. You've hit the jackpot with this. Hand over the chip. Let's see what's on it. Uh, I'm not sure I want to do this now. When you're ready, let us know. The information on that chip could save a lot of lives. Interesting. Do we have to give it to the railroad, or is there alternate options? Have the Corsa chip analyzed. It doesn't necessarily say return the Corsa chip to Desdemona, does it? I presume if you were further through the Brotherhood storyline, you... Might be able to get it analyzed there. But who else would we take it to at this stage if not Desdemona and, and, and the railroad? Like, like maybe maybe I will go back to no. Brian Virgil and see what he says. Because he was the one who set us up on this whole journey. I just feel like that's not the right way to go about things. Surely someone else can analyze it, right? Otherwise, we're basically locking ourselves in with the railroad. I don't mind the railroad. I think they're... It's better to be a noble idiot than uh, a, 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 a an intelligent piece of shit. You can put that on my epitaph. Hello. Protect and Hello. serve. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Uh, doctor? Uh, Virgil? He just, like, actually will not... He's, like, refusing to speak with us. Okay. Um, do we know any other doctors? We could try the... 
try the memory den? I don't really know where else I would go, though. Oh, I guess we'll just head back. I, I feel like... I, I worry that there might be something... Oh, come on, let's add a fast travel from anywhere mod. Why not? <laughs> it's just inconvenient, isn't it? More bloody loading screens. Um... Yeah, I, I feel like there might be more to this quest. I feel like that there might be an option to go and get it analyzed somewhere else, but we don't know of anyone. And look, we haven't done the storyline to get up to that point, if there is. So I guess this is just the way the chips have fallen. So we'll head back to uh, Railroad HQ and we'll trust Tinker Tom the lunatic. Everybody knows the best hackers are the ones with tinfoil up their walls. That's not even... Glad you're with us. Go and look up that image of the Pirate Bay founder. He looks like Shaggy. He looks like Shaggy in a tinfoil den. He's built like a Faraday cage around his entire basement. I'm not joking. Hello. Ready to hand over that chip, long. Agent? But I got my Let's see if we can get that code you need. Yeah. Help out the Let's trust you to the guy who just screamed about how people need to lay off him for doing too many chems. All right. Tom, make it happen. I suppose we could just go kill another courser. Let's have the circuit analyzer take a crack at you. Okay. There it is. What is that? It's like a big, big microscope. What is that? What have you got there? Let's kill it. Just... Chip accessed. Just poke the analog connectors. Oh, he's plugged it in. It's shaking violently. What? Oh man, don't, don't, don't crash. Hold it together. Memory hiccup. Here it comes. Uh huh. Encryption algorithms. All right, all right, we're still running. Oh man, they've added more decimals to the last cipher. This is gonna be. Come on, baby, show me that pattern. Where is it? Wait, they're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. Oh man, we got luck. I got you, you institute. Best. How can the Institute you. simultaneously be the most Sorry. terrifying, frightening scientific organization to exist, producing artificial code. humans, yet yeah, their most protected piece of technology can be hacked by a bloke wearing a hat in a basement? Good work, Tom. You're taking a lot of the wind out of their sails. I'm not sure our luck will hold up next time, Des. And agent, I hope that helps you as much as you've helped us. Good work. Use I was the back entrance. Too much traffic through the church, and we'll burn this hideout. I was kind of hoping maybe you go around and you recruit a bunch of people, and then they're together. Together, they would overcome. Now we gotta go back and see Doctor Virgil. Okay, fair enough. Like, you, you, you go to Virgil first, and maybe they, you'd all meet up, and then they'd do a bit of hacking. Those synths could drop in. You have to fight them off. And then, oh, I'm done right at the last second just as the synths come in. But no, it's just like Tinker Tom's going to plug it into his USB drive and just fuck around with it for 15 seconds. <laughs> Not like, give us a week. Come back in a week, and we'll have this done. It forced time. Things boring. You could just sit there and wait it out, I suppose. But it would help make it a bit more believable. Wasn't sure I'd see you again. You saw me about you five minutes ago. to get what you need. Yes, I have the code. Suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. How'd you manage to get it decoded? Ah, uh, the railroad helped me. Oh God, those kooks. I would have expected they'd be too busy trying to liberate vending machines <laughs> or setting computer terminals free or... Sorry. They just have something of a reputation. You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could. From memory and things I've overheard through the years. Came up with some schematics for you. Wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. Here's the symbol explanation. Oh. You need to build a device if I... that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest I... part of the design? That classical music station. Oh! That's the carrier signal for the, the one we've been listening from the very start? All the on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. The irony. I want to be clear that this isn't my area of expertise. I was bioscience, not engineering or advanced systems or anything. These scientists are insane if he can also be a, a transition from bioscience to a teleports or engineering from memory. Uh, it'll work. For the record, I haven't made any promises. I can fix your mistakes, don't worry. If you can build this device, Virgil, maybe like eight intelligence. Code, you Planting much 14 just as a reminder. the signal from the Institute's relay. Can you? I mean, can you build it? You have people that can help. 
This is a lot for one person, even you. Ah, uh, I've got it covered, Virgil. Good, good. Because you've got to make it If I, there, for both our sakes, was in charge of the Super Mutant Project. Our agreement. I've helped you as best I can. If you make it in there, you find that serum. It's but my only hope for ever being normal. So you find it. Now go on. Take these. If I was in charge work. of the Super Mutant Project, you do whatever it takes. Call on whoever I you would know absolutely, to help you. without a shadow of a doubt, have inserted like, 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 like fur jeans. Okay, hear me out. It's going to sound a bit weird. You got to hear me out. There's a good reason for it. Fur jeans into the Super Mutant Project, right? And then, imagine this, this, this stature, this height, ability to talk, but furry, like say, for example, a gorilla. You give them all yellow ties, red ties. You give them all red ties. And then boom, you've just made Donkey Kong. It's a lack of imagination. It's an absolute lack of imagination coming from the Institute and the Master, to be fair. No imagination at all. Because if people saw Super Mutants and they were just like gorillas, like talking gorillas, they go, a talking gorilla, it goes from being horrifying to everybody wants to talk with the gorilla. It's, it's an absolute marketing fail. And, and if you can do that kind of effect, I'm sure that inserting a gene to make you grow fur. It would cover up all that. <laughs> he thinks he can read. It would cover up all of the, uh, all of the frightening, you know, uh, de deformations and tumors and everything else. And you would just look like a big furry gorilla with a tie. A branding issue. Absolute branding issue. Thank you for joining me today. Uh, Planty Mush. Is going to sort through all of our junk. We'll be back on Sunday, which I suppose will be tomorrow for you as you're watching this. Uh, and I'll catch up with all your comments over the last couple of days. And then we'll just be on a normal schedule for a while. So I record, you watch, I read your comments and then say, that's a very good point. Or look at that idiot. And then we carry on per usual. Thank you. Oh, but look, what, what, what do you think about this main quest as well, by the way? Talks to the Railroad, talks to the Minutemen, talks to the Brotherhood. We don't need to talk to anyone. We could just, we could just do it by ourselves. Ooh, now that could be an idea. Either way, see you all very soon.